So the holidays are upon us. They're rapidly approaching. Rapidly. And, you know, it is like, it's getting crazy. You know, like how much do you feel like uh, one of those things, those inflatable things outside of a car dealership just throwing, you know, flailing, just like can't contain yourself. You're just like, you want to freak out and throw a tantrum. Does it have to be a struggle? Does it need to be that much of a struggle? This twin flame journey. Journey home. Does it need to be like this crazy? Crazy. No, it absolutely does not. Uh, go ahead and hit the like button. And uh, visit asoneguidance.com. Like the majority of these things that you're going through, uh, I've already worked through. And I can certainly help you do that for yourself through coaching sessions uh, or build your foundation. Building your foundation on unconditional love uh to getting into union, uh, which I have an e-course on my website that, you know, the first three lessons are free that will uh, very much help you along the way. Uh, but struggle, struggling, like what are you fighting against? When you're trying to, you know, you're, you are where you are. Right? Like, you're where you are. Your twin is where they are. Like, you are working toward uh, union. You are doing the things necessary that is required for you to uh, get into union. You, these lessons have to be learned. These things, uh, there's no way around it. So, like, acknowledging that what what is right now is what it is like you are where you're at like let think of it this way like just let uh picture yourself in a stream and like you know the current the current is just taking you on your merry way and you got a big smile on your face and like you know you come to a part where there like, might be like trees and branches blocking your way blocks and you remove these things and then you keep, you know, the current keeps taking you and then you hit the next set of uh, branches and you clear those out of the way and keep going. All along the way, this these things keep coming up. You're letting, you're just floating along, letting, letting the current take you where it needs to, where you want to go because that's where you need to go in order to get to get to the destination that you're looking to arrive at but if you're swinging swimming against the current or you know flailing all over the place uh, you're not moving anywhere you're, you're fighting against everything you're trying to control where it is you're going and that's not exactly what's going to take you to, to, to your destination and you could feel how you're doing these things by like what it feels inside. Like if it's if you feel like you're struggling, then you could picture yourself, you know, in that stream, like trying to swim the wrong way, or trying to like, or just flailing all over the place, and you're not going anywhere, and you feel like you're drowning, or you're like, uh, you know, choosing to just like. Hold on to a branch because you're scared to go with the current. You're scared to go downstream. Like, accept what is happening to you. Accept where you are. Like, only then can you move forward. Accept that this is, this is what it is right now. This is your journey. This is where a spot that you are on your journey. Accept that for what it is. you keep projecting that like you're somewhere where you're not then you're then you're not in the right now you're not being right now you're not uh, acknowledging that 
you're that you are where you are. You're not. You're just, uh, you know, making pretend that something else is is occurring when when it really isn't. That's throwing curveballs and wrenches and, and it's giving you a struggle. And it's like you you can feel that because you are you're burnt out or you're exhausted or you're drained. You know, these these things need to be like this control of having to do it yourself or, ha or making it happen yourself needs to be surrendered. You need to surrender that control to... Uh, the universe or God, which whatever, whatever uh, life force that you believe in, because that's the only way that's that's going to get you to your destination. And working through uh, the blocks that are keeping you, right? Like you're not in control of this journey. It's not you that's. That's making all this shit happen. Understand that. Understand this is a divine journey. That like all of these things that you have done in the past, like control your way into a relationship or control uh, a partner from from the past, doesn't work. Doesn't work in a union. You won't get there by by controlling your way into union. Can't control anything to get into union. You have to let that go. And the sooner you do that, the sooner you surrender and you go with the flow and you you know sit in sit in your in the little stream in your current and let it take you to where it wants to take you while you, you know, clear the shit out of the way in order to get there, the more momentum you'll build and the faster that you will get into union. So, remember, relax. Relax and have faith that you're being led all the way where to where you need to go and the amount of work that you put into it is, uh, determines how fast that it goes so if you're willing to uh, put in daily work and you know this is the the most important and this is the number one priority in your life then you will get there you know, faster than if you just, you know, didn't do that. It's not for you to determine. So visit asoneguidance.com, uh, connect with me, and uh, I will see you next time.